Yo, what's up, YouTube? This is your boy, Shy Baker, a.k.a. LMC6 Kicks Review. Back at y'all again. As y'all can see, we had some a lot of, a ton of heat dropped this week. Uh, but today, we're going to be looking at a KD7 SE. Physical size of it is, is, a, is a 10 and a half. Kind of got tongue-tied. Colorway, uh, official colorway is multicolor Black Horizon. She suggested retail price is a uh, $200. And uh, SE, I'm um, guessing it stands for Special Edition. C1 and KD, one C1 KD box, you've seen them all, just the receipt. But uh, let's go ahead and jump right into the review. Starting out with the sole, of course. Uh, we got two translucent soles, as you can see. Uh, you got the purple hint right here in the middle. Uh, you also got that, uh, I guess that's Royal Blue, or Orlando Blue, you would call it. You got more of that, uh, it's like a fuchsia colorway. I know it's probably coming up red on the camera but it's a, it's a fuchsia colorway uh, you also got lime green on the hint right here in this uh air unit and uh we're gonna start out with the all-star shoe i'm just calling that because that's the strap uh starting out with the shoe of course as you can see it's a multi-color black horizon starting out with the midsole we got a black midsole well we got a black hint of the midsole right here that air unit is in that lime green or that vocal colorway it says nike zoom midsole is white got a hint of that teal right there coming up to this crazy swoosh as you can see the design on it a couple of shoes got this uh, got this design but off the top uh, just because I got my uh, bad apples in the house uh, that's what that is right there covered around to the front of the toe box as you can see it is a uh, crazy theme underneath there just off the top of my head I'm gonna say this is like a, a a thermal map print as you can see if you refer back refer back to your uh, uh, your weatherman sevens as you can see you'll see a hint of that rain on the uh on the on the shoe coming on up to the strap you got the all-star strap with the three five in it which make up the seven i'll turn it around you can see it right there the vocal strap is in that lime green well volt colorway whatever you want to call it coming up to the tongue you got that uh that easter tongue with that uh kd logo and it is from the global games with that speckling on it which is nice curve around to the other side of the shoe you got some more Hence of that lime green right there or that volt colorway more that white midsole no speckling in it. i thought it was a midsole from non pearls but it doesn't have speckling in it coming to this back back part of the shoe you got this uh material right here and it is in that 3m i want to say that's from the all-star colorway i do not know what this uh this colorway is from and as you can see uh the material that they use on this one is off the global games it's that uh that synthetic leather Cover around to this swoosh right here. I have no idea what this swoosh is from. If you do know, comment below and let me know. I'm assuming this right here is from the Global Game. Do not know what this uh this is from. Back of the tongue, off the top, I would say uh the Weatherman's, but that right there is is, is too bright. I'm I'm not sure what that's from. The laces, swing break back is multicolor as you can see. Inside of the footbed, it is an All-Star Game, and uh the sock liner is a. Uh, if you remember the uh the uh I want to say uh they was cool waters or something it was like a uh like a, a, a ocean blue colorway the the back part of on the design on the panel they use that and threw it in the sock liner as you can see physical size is a ten and a half if you want to get in there and check it out once again the footbed is from the All Star Games uh give y'all another quick close up look at this uh this design as you can see you can see the water looks like raindrops from the Weatherman Seven they just threw it in an actual water colorway. The fly wire on this side is orange and it's blue on this side. You want to get a peep of it. Lace tips are white. Uh, there's a KD logo again. And the names in the strap in case you want to see them. It says Warner, Barbara, Wayne, and Tony. Closing that up. Another hint of that uh, material. As you can see, it, it just looks like a weather pattern to me, man. I might be wrong. But uh, I'm pretty sure that's a, we a weather pattern. They just went went all out with it with the colors and everything. As you can see, looks like water right there. Looks like you know what I'm saying maybe a hurricane or something. Looks like water going up the up the horizon. I don't know, man. It just looks like a a water. It just looks like a thermal map print to me. Another look at this swoosh. Back part of the shoe again. And uh, let's go ahead and jump into the other one, which is I ain't gonna say my favorite one, but it is an eye catcher. Starting out with the midsole, you got another white and white and black mixed midsole. As you can see in this midsole, it has speckles. Now on pearls, it has speckles, but it was like a, a a polarized pink tint to it. This just has that uh those silver flakes in it. The air uh unit is in that blue. You got the hint of that uh 35,000 degree on the back. 
It's part of the panel right here. I forgot what this is from, but this is from the All-Star game, and this is in 3M. Oh, this is 3M, actually. Curve around to the back of the shoe. More of that All-Star hint. You got a hint of that pink. And okay, and right here is All-Star again. It is in that blue. And right here on this black and white swoosh, it's black and white, but uh, it's, it is it is the weather, man. They just threw the black and white to it, and it made it like the Black History Month. I wish they had left the same color, but... uh. Color contrast is on point to me, so no complaints. The sock liner on this one, as you can see, you can see it right here. Now, once again, just like the uh, those cool waters, whatever the color, what it was called on the All Star strap shoe, this one right here is uh, it's inspired by the Global Games. You remember on your, oh, not on your Global Games, but on your gold medals on the panel, it had that carbon fiber like material look to it, and that's what this makes up, as you can see, carbon fiber look to it. While we in here, we can look at the. Uh, the eggnog, as you can see, let me pull that paper out real quick if I can. Y'all give me a second. Pull the paper out and I'll uh, show you that uh, the insole. Kevin Durant's favorite egg, eggnog, 35 milliliter ounces. Curving to this back side of the shoe again, as you can see that low, I mean that swoosh right there. More of that pink right there. Front of the toe box. And to me, this one makes up a a, a multicolor uh, camo. That's what it looks like to me. Also, looks like it be it could be inspired by some some eggs. You know what I'm saying? But uh, it looks like a multicolor uh, camo print to me. If you ask me, open up the strap. You got that that colorway right there on the strap. That uh, bolt colorway or that uh, lime green, whatever you want to call it. And uh, the readings on this one as well. You're not gonna be able to read that. Let me stop dragging the shoe. Hints of that pink right there. Multicolor uh, laces again. Lime green or bolt on this side with that uh that red or looks like it be it can be the colorway uh off the fly wire off the globe not the globe games on the why I keep saying that but the gold medals curving up to the top of the tongue. You got the KD logo and it is in that black black history month thing with that like silver metallic look to it. Tongue is blue but it has a translucent tint over it. Curving to the back side of the shoe. If anybody know what this is from, please let me know because I have no idea. Lace tips on this one is uh, clear as well. No glow in the dark. Just features at 3M. The uh, Aunt Pearl strap. And there's a look of that uh, Black History Month uh, swoosh right here. And just another hint of the laces. And uh, that right there about wraps up the review. Man, I just want to give you all a quick, quick, detailed review look of this shoe. Uh hope everybody was able to cop these was able to cop i actually had a a buddy of mine look out for me uh charged me two what was it 245 ship um so it was better than paying 300 or 285 what i've been seeing on uh on instagram and ebay but i appreciate y'all watching my review make sure y'all stay tuned to my channel for more reviews in the future and uh cop what you like and not the hype peace